Oh, good morning, everyone. Um, well, you've all seen this in the papers, right? So it's a really good thing that Tesco's have made a stand against kids uh, having sugary drinks in the lunchbox. And rightly so. You know, we all know sugar's a big problem, don't we? Eh? Okay, so from the 7th of September, uh, Tesco's have vowed to ban Ribena, Capri Sun and a whole host of other sugary cartoned drinks. This has caused a massive uproar on Twitter, which I find really amusing. There is actually a group um, saying, save Ribena. Oh, come on, give me a break. Okay, so let's just, let's just take this step by step, okay? Okay, so uh, it's really good that Tesco's have taken it upon themselves to um, take a stand and fight against the, uh, the sugar addiction of UK, right? But then the first thing you see when you come through the door, alcohol, energy drinks, and of course, sugary cereal. But that's not the kicker. This is the kicker. As you walk through the door, crispy cremes. Okay, so I'll be honest. Um, Tesco's and Whiteley, um, actually, this aisle isn't as big as some of them I've seen. Uh, there's actually a good selection of uh, some bottled water there, which is actually pretty good. Um, but let's just take this into context of the video, right? There's Ribena in a small section of the of the uh, the shelves. Okay, so they're going to go. They're going to go. Um, but what I don't understand is you've got all these that they're going to keep. Most of all, they're going to sell this to kids, which is going to be. This is what kids are drinking nowadays. This is the sort of stuff that should be banned for high sugar content. So it just, it, you know, makes you think who's behind all these decisions, you know, is it a market employee from Tesco's to get rid of the stuff that isn't selling or are they actually trying to make a statement? Because if they're making a statement about um, reducing the level of sugar in kids lunchbox and surely they would look at other avenues and not just a couple of brands. So are Tesco's taking that stand against obesity in children or in general in fact? Um, what do you guys think? I'd love to hear your thoughts. Um, I am, of course, an advocate of freedom of choice. Um, so I believe that supermarkets should have, um, you know, a good choice and a good variety for the variety of society that we have. Um, I would, however, say that if they're going to make a statement as bold as what they have, I think they need to reevaluate what they're offering uh, on a day to day basis. Um, comment below. I'd love to hear your thoughts and uh, have a wonderful Friday. And like I said yesterday, make today a good day. Enjoy.